Schneider. Toronto 11th in the majors in runs scored per game. George Springer has been hot in the past month. That is Dean Kramer who pitched very well against the Jays in his first start against Toronto. really good about Dean Kramer right now. He'll face George Springer and he'll feel good about that start. That's seven. Keep that ball down on the way really well. Try to do it right there. Another cutter. He took a little bit off. Sweep Kramer. Corner. That is a fair ball. Line and extra bases. So leadoff runner on second. Both to the right side. It's kicked by Frazier. He'll recover. And Amir Guerrero Jr. Takes a tailing fastball. It's and he got a piece of that changeup. It might be going down with a breaking ball. Wanted though, left a cutter out over the heart of the plate to score Springer and make it one nothing. Here's Matt Chapman. And he strikes him out. Pretty wicked command for the most part for Dean, who checks on Guerrero. Pretty aggressive Blue Jays team. Player that will land foul. The Bach. There are field and he will get there. Aaron Hick. Gunnar Henderson leading off for Baltimore today. The Orioles sixth in the majors. Five runs. Throw everything and the kitchen sink at you. Yeah, when we show you Chris Plus slugging mark. And a ground ball yanked foul here off a of chain. Years ago against Cleveland. Did he swing here? No, according to Brock Baloo with lefties. And he gets a little extra here on the sweeper. Numbers overall are as good as they are because that can, that can shake some confidence, no. especially the first start of the season. In the American League. Right, that ball is ticketed for the fence and it kicks away from Springer. He's in high five on Sunday. They have uh, really taken to this birdbath. Every club hopes to get that type of player. Not fooled by that swing. Cloud. Any of them, I don't know if he's going to ever throw all of them in the same game. Maybe he does, but um, sometimes when the, that had to be a very satisfying. Dalton Varsho will snap that streak of us with the headphones on. Got the MLB.TV broadcast plugged in. Kramer. O'Hearn, it will get to the wall and right throw will not be. Wall for the double. So another leadoff double and a strike to R. They're chasing and he makes a fine play and takes third. Stanley Chanson fouls one back. Brandon had said before the game that is physically that that you're not you know comfortable with. Including cut fastball and he throws a good cut fastball here. Stuff in, in some jams but he gets out of fire and he's going to get out of this one. First show stranded and tell us about the situation with Ryan. Just that he's got some vertigo symptom the bat. San Francisco he's won the bat well up all. It will get down in fair territory. Hayes. Aaron Hicks head toward the netting and out of play. Hey Brandon. Playing pressure for young players because it's just so hard to do and seen it before and work. You couldn't tell. Sir, get up. That one is gonna go crazy and it is too. Not if they keep doing that. No. <laughs> Manager interview Bob. And the Orioles have the lead as Arias strikes out against Chris and Jorge Mateo. By the way, another $500 for Bradford Gist today's, but 13 of those 61 have left. It's a little tapper from Mateo, and Bassett has no player. But now Mateo can try to do a little damage on the bases and try to get the score. To lefties. You just never know this guy. That's a sinker slammed out of play. We'll go. And he will come back. He'll have the plaque, so I probably would have lost the ball. Third. Now Bo Bichette. That is a little high to Rutschman. Much trouble right now. Man, right side that is picked by Merrifield. Hit hard right to more runs out of it, maybe. Adam Frazier's two-run home run. While well, Brandon joined us an inning ago, gives they're good, they're young. A lot for a long time. As Springer. Starts Tampa Bay, notwithstanding. <laughs> Baseman Arias, Bo Bichette, Blister, and nobody out. Let's see if he can make his way through the through the next two or three bat. Ten-year veteran back there. Tried to go up and in, missed the target. That's he almost got Guerrero to go after it, and he got him here, right on right changeup. Twenty-three. That ball is foul. Two on, one out. 
Frazier called off by Santander. And Kramer gets out of it. Jim. Jim Palmer, who will be back with us on the chase 37 and 30. Getting past Guerrero and Anthony Santander smoked. Good swing by Santander. Oriole lefties. And we mentioned to fly out to left field in the first. Kiermeyer got a great jump, but it will not miss. Split. Like Santander did, he actually goes the other way, head down on it. We hit it pretty good, but just a, a really good swing on, a, on a, what I thought was a pretty good pitch. Right on her now, five home runs, 25 games. Hit. So far for Bassett. There's Frazier, who's eighth home run, increase in home run rate. Just amazing. Oops. To the wrong part of the ballpark. And Adam is one. Six batter of the inning. Ramona Reed is cracked into right field, and Hicks will. 14. His season high in hits allowed was 10. There's a nine in. And, and Guerrero Jr. does. And Arias the runners. Three and two. Two in a strike zone. Arias will run on 3 2. And Mateo takes ball four. He is pumped. I don't know the first pitch. He hit the wall. And he did. Grand slam gutter. Oh, what a night. He, I actually think he thought he was going to make that play. Of course, he thinks he's going to make them you know all. What? I did too. We've <laughs> seen him make about. Two and two for Adley. It's not even warm out here in Baltimore yet. Gutter. Into the right field corner, Adley Rush double. That's that focus that Adley Rushman has as a young guy at the big league level. He just, he, he. And there will be a 33rd. Yeah, it started off with. Three and two. And that'll do it. Son, why did you get uh, a black and pineapple? Better field. That's a gap splitter for Var. And he'll pump the break. How'd you stay fresh after the tricky sinker? That is a strike call to Kirk, two and two. That was as close as. For Kirk scoring Varsho, he will run back quickly off of Dean Kirk. He's got to bear down and make some quality pitches. And that one's high to Danny Jansen. One and two. Fouls away a cutter. In the game, you still have a tendency to do that. That's to first. O'Hearn will go to second. And but I think, I, I, you know, I, I think you should pitch the score was, you know, a three or four run lead. Springer yanks it to third. Urias goes to second. Just barely getting. Situation here where I was not always enamored with having to come in. When I was, when I did uh, become a. There's two walks on the homestand. And wow, that pitch missed the target and the strike zone. Yeah, you don't get the call. So that that was not a very good call, clearly. No, it, by hey, the call. three and two thirds in his career. He's got good stuff. He's got really good stuff. The only thing is, and the Orioles were hitting the ball hard off of him. So that's just really front. I, I think it was a, a really frustrating. Hearn homer and a Henderson grand slam. Orioles also a two run. And it is off the pole. A beautiful. Right in the center of the pole. And whoa, whoa, whoa. Second big league year. Get lines out to right. And the pretty baseball league, which is a little crazy at 63 doing that. We've seen some of the Orioles starting pitchers wearing the visor sunglasses and they never take them off at this point. Right back, stuck it in the glove and he gets Guerrero. After mm -hmm. just in the moment. In the moment it's all good but right after that then you realize it 12 mile an hour faster. And remember when, when that ball's coming back to the pitch. First one two three. And he'll get it. 
Strike three called his fifth punch out. And will bat third in this inning against Bowden Francis. Yeah, I, I, I think what would have been destroyed last game. I tell you what, maybe a little bit lost. It. So therefore he has a chance to hit the ball to all fields, and he did just that. Ball up. That tail right at Varsha. Off Chris Bassett. On Friday, he went three for three. Thick. This is a laser show. Pete Walker's out again. It's a flip dots. I hope one of the Orioles don't run up and knock it out of her hand. They might think it's a pitch. Orioles tonight have hit 10 balls in it and bout. And Kiermeyer is there. Adley two. That got that explosion of an inning started. That's down for a base hit. And Orias with on an 0-2 pitch. No. Oh, her there. And that'll do it. Allow it.